Well, good morning, everybody. I thought you'd make, want to make breakfast with me. I'm making an omelet and a pickle sandwich. So, right there. And I cut all the veggies up. Put out the oven. Got my peppers. Got my onions. Some ham. And some tomatoes. I'm going to pour it all in the butter. Yeah, I cook with butter. I don't like margarine. I'll, I'll use plant-based butter, but I don't cook with artificial stuff. And I don't use that much butter. I only use my food, and not a lot. And I'm asking my cholesterol all the time. So how's everybody doing? I am doing just fine. Scramble my eggs. Me and my husband. Going to the farmer's market today. My nose is it. I don't know why. What does that mean? I know when they say your right hand into somebody's going to give you some money. That's never happened to me, though. Has it happened to you? I'm just wondering. Okay, so let's just stir this up. I'm using the, what is it, the Michelangelo. These are my new pans, and I'm loving them. They don't stick. They are, um, I'll tell you in a minute. I think it's Michelangelo. Okay, one minute. Let me stir this up just a little bit. Yeah. They are um, Michael Michelangelo, and they are really really good. And um, those are the best pans that I have had in a while. And I've purchased some really good pans. I was gonna purchase. I got them during the Amazon Prime sale. I was gonna purchase the ones that were two hundred and something dollars, but these were marked from like two hundred to about ninety five or something like that. So I just bought them. And like I said, the pants are tremendous. And I've already burnt something, so it doesn't stick. So that's good. And it's not got the coat. If you look at it, it doesn't have the coating in there. So, I mean, they're really good. I gotta get out some cheese. I'm gonna go to the refrigerator. I'll be right back. You didn't see the, the, uh, the, the um, video on how I fixed my crisper. Look at it. It's actually pretty interesting. I was even interested when I did it. I um, did it because you, know, you could always buy a new one, but it, it, was, it would be terrible. It just needed some flat, it needed some epoxy, and I fixed it. So I'm, I'm good with it. For now, anyway. You know, so, but I mean, I have to, um, I cleaned it out pretty much, but I have to really do a deep cleaning. So I think maybe you might want to come along and clean with me. That would be fun. Everybody else does, and I, and I express and understand it, but understand it now. Okay, I'm going to pour the egg in. Stay there, please. Here's time to cook that. 
down a little bit. I'm going to go get some plate. Now, you know, plating is not my forte. And it should be because I did, well, I went to cooking school to learn how to cook certain things. I never taught about plating. Not what I took anyway. It did teach about plating if you wanted to go on, but I just wanted to cook, learn how to cook a few things. But um, plating is not my forte. But I'm going to get better at it. You know, I just put it on a plate. You know what I mean? I've never actually plated a pretty, pretty plate of food. But I'll get there. I will. I'm going to go get the plates. We'll be right back. Play nicely with one another. No hitting, no fighting, no beating, no, no biting, no spitting, none of that. I'm back. Okay, I'm going to turn this down just a little bit more and put the cheese in. Put away. While I'm waiting for that, we can be putting the butter up. Yep, so put a little bit more butter in. Then what I'm gonna do is when I get when the when the um arm is finished, I'm gonna old school some toast. Yeah, we gotta toast it. He uses it. I like my toast old school when mom used to do it. In the pan. Now we have over here, and I'll actually give you a tour around the house. I'm going to try to get into using this movie thing, movie camera. But I have um, cast iron pans. Some of them are my mother's, some of his mother's. And my mother used to do, do our, our toast. And I think we had a toaster too. When I was little, I don't remember, but I know we had a toaster. And my mother would still do it in the pan. And I love it in the pan. Frying pan on both sides, butter. Mm, this is great. a new trick the other day. 
don't know who it was. It might have been Liz Fenwick, I'm not sure, but she said that when you take the, the bread, you twist it, and she's been looking for the tie, and then pull it over like this. It's neat, isn't it? See it? Real easy. You learn something new every day. That's how I feel anyway. Get this is ready to How was everybody's day today? What'd you do? Thursday, you know. One more, two more days and then you got the weekend. We have a long weekend too, don't we? Really nice. I'm going to get some things done. I hope to be able to. Every time, every time I try to go out to replant some things because I'm trying to start my, my winter planting, you know, because up until about November and December, I can still plant. Well, I can plant, like garlic I can plant now. I'm going to plant my garlic, plant my other stuff. But every time I get up and I say, yeah, I'm going to do my plants today. It rains. I don't know why. I don't know why. Well, I'm not asking God why, but I'm just saying, you know, it bothers me. Okay, so. Really good, but hey, it is what it is. I'm probably breaking half the and half as much. I'm gonna put it on the plate, then I'll show you how. And I'm sure you already know how, but if you don't, try it. My grandkids love it, they won't use the toaster in their hand. They're like, No, we want grandma's. But I got from my mom, she probably got it from her mom, and so on and so forth. Me, but I get it done. Still have to learn how to, how to coordinate and strengthen my hand. Not strengthen it, but you know, I mean, there are some things that are just awkward for me that were never awkward before. But I live with it. I do my best. Trust me. Okay, we're going to move these off the pan, but I'm going to show it to you first. That's pretty good for an old lady. I'm going to put these in the plate, put this in the microwave and get the bread started.
I like bread. I'm not trying to sound like her because she loves bread. I like bread. Okay, so that there. Now, turn the pan on. So turn the pan on. Get ready to do the bread. Here's the omelet. Kind of broken, but it's good. It looks good. So, like I said, and I cut it in half too. Half for my husband, half for me. So now, butter up the bread. Let me wipe this knife for I'm going to do his first. What I do is I butter the bread like this, like your regular butter bread. I'm sure you've done it before. Nothing I have not ever shown you. But I do it like this. Put some in there. Now, I'm going to actually show you how to make butter, if you haven't seen it, but I'm going to also show you when I do the butter, I'm going to also show you how to make the uh, plant-based butter. So these are his. Okay. Again, I'm going to show you this. Twist it, twist it, twist it. Put it flat down. Pull the top over like this. And you don't have to worry about the ties and those little those little bands that you, you lose somehow. He likes white bread. I like wheat bread. Excuse me, I'll pick up something. I don't know how I dropped it, but I did. Wipe it out too. <laughs> okay, so the bread is twisting. So now we're going to turn it over with the fork. I'm going to make his plate, and I'm going to fix mine. So, while I'm waiting for that bread to cook, I'm going to fix his plate. I'm going to get this bread out.
put mine in, and then I'll show you this place, and then I'm going to go. Because i got to get him, and you have to eat. Because we're going shopping today. So come back later, because I'm going to be doing reviews. And a few things that I, that I got shopping. Okay, so this is how you do it. Breakfast. The breakfast of champions. I love you all. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye. See you in the next video.